Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Drip Wild. Today we are talking about three services that deliver cigarettes and vapes. So with all of the services in the world that offer same day delivery for almost anything, one of the most underserved communities in all of the gig economy are those looking for cigarettes and vapes. But that doesn't mean they're not being served at all. It means you have to look a little deeper for them. So with that said, I'm gonna go over three services that deliver cigarettes and vape. How you can use them to order for yourself and everything in between. But before we do that, let's go over a quick disclaimer. The content of this video does not contain, it's never intended to be legal business, financial, tax, or health advice of any kind. This video is for entertainment purposes only. It is advised how you conduct your own research and consult with qualified professionals before applying anything online. I also want to be clear that everything that we're going to be going over in this video, especially with the deeper legal issues with delivering tobacco in general, is very market dependent. What applies to me and my market may not apply to you. So with that said, let's get started. Big Daddy, Wines and Liquors. Big Daddy Wines and Liquors is a franchise of liquor stores that also has a selection of cigarettes available. They use City Hive, which is a white label e-commerce platform and has a wide selection of not just liquors, but also cigarettes available on their website. Now this may not be seen as an important note, but most third party apps actually make it clear that they do not want tobacco products delivered on their platform. And most companies don't even know that stores have their own website, so that way they can outsource it to said third-party apps. The only time I've ever delivered for City Hive is when a customer decided to go through City Hive, and then that restaurant outsourced the actual delivery to DoorDash or Uber Eats, and that's how I ended up getting the deliveries. Some merchants don't even know having their own website and doing that specific thing is actually an option available to them. So if you know that there's a store that's actually on third-party apps, that sells tobacco products in general, but and doesn't have their own website, let them know about City Hive. In the meantime, if you have Big Daddy Wines and Liquors in your area, see if they have a selection of cigarettes from your local store. DoorDash and Uber Eats, kind of. I know, I know, I just said DoorDash and Uber Eats make it clear that they don't sell tobacco products on their platform, and yes, they do make it clear that they don't, but that doesn't stop some merchants from trying. In my area, there are actually a couple of different stores that offer vapes and other smoking products and literally nothing else. Because what else does a smoke shop have to sell, yeah? But the thing about finding them is not searching by product type because if you type it into DoorDash or Uber Eats that you're looking for vapes or jewels or whatever, it's actually not gonna pop up. I have to type in the individual store name in order to actually be able to find it in the first place. If your local smoke shop isn't on there, they're either trying to game the system, they aren't looking to get into the delivery space at all, or they're just not aware of their options. So next time you go to your local shop, let them know, hey, this is an option for you. WeDeliverVapes.com. I know it's a little on the nose in terms of the name, but the service literally does deliver vapes. They offer same day delivery for Palm Beach County, Broward County, and Miami Dade County, and nationwide shipping for anywhere outside of those counties. And even provide wholesale prices for those who sell in their own stores. They seem to outsource their deliveries to Rody as opposed to DoorDash, Uber Eats, or Grubhub. And yes, some DoorDash, Uber Eats, and Grubhub drivers have also signed up to be a Rody driver, but their pay model's a little different in comparison. So feel free to order from them. One last note before I close out, no matter which app you're ordering from, just know that everything that I said was market to market, but being old enough to order at all and having an ID checked properly is pretty much universal. Gig workers are not only required to check your ID, they literally cannot move on without doing so. Not to mention, they will literally be paying more for bringing the item back to the store as opposed to just handing it to you. So please, F around and find out. And no, these aren't the only services that offer tobacco delivery. In fact, I made another video on this subject with different services entirely. I will leave that video in the description, so feel free to check that out. And if those stores don't offer said tobacco products in your local area, Area either. You can always make like Snoop Dogg and just quit smoking yourself, yeah? Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. As always, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace!